Hi, my name is Emily Malafay, and I'm from St. Xavier High School. And for my research project, I decided to experiment the effect of temperature on plant growth. Now, this rise in temperature in our planet is called global warming. So for this experiment, I wanted to test how this rise in temperature will ultimately affect our plant's health and growth. So for this experiment, I decided to set up three different basal plants, and they were all in the same vicinity, more or less. And um, for group one, that plant, I applied no heat to that plant the whole day. Um, for group two, I applied heat only half of the day, and the rest of the day, it had no heat applied to it. And for group three, this is the one that um, applied heat uh, the entire day throughout the whole experiment. So you also have to realize that plants have an equilibrium balance to keep in check, just like humans do. So if the temperature is too high or too low uh, for this um, equilibrium, or if it goes outside of that, for example, humans have a um, an equilibrium of 97 degrees Fahrenheit to 99 degrees Fahrenheit. If it goes outside of this, we could be seriously harmed or in worst cases, we could die if this is untreated. So um, the same way, if there's too much heat, if there's too little heat, this will affect the plant. We can see here with too much heat, too much humidity, those, they're both um, directly correlated because with more heat, there's more humidity typically as um, heat holds humidity better. We can see here that patches of gray mold start to appear in the leaves as well as flowers or buds that appear on the plants will start to get covered with gray mold. And here with too little humidity, we can see that the leaf tips will become brown and shriveled and the buds and flowers will start to also shrivel and fall off.